Hello, it's Jason Payne for JDP Realty Group, a cold banker, Dan Hop Realtor. Well, today I'm in the beautiful community of Veramindi in New Braunfels, Texas, and I'm gonna do a follow-up video for a house that's being built by David Weekly for one of my out-of-state clients. Let's go check it out. I apologize if I was making a funny face just then at the intro because the sun was beaming right in my eyes. Now, both David Weekly and Scott Felder build in this part of Veramindi, and the thing I like so much about this community is, oh, there's the sun, uh, is the proximity to all the fun stuff that New Braunfels has to offer. You are right down the, right across the street from the New Braunfels High School and just a hop, skip, and a jump away from anything and everything in New Braunfels to include green and the downtown area. And Landa Park is right around the corner as well. I love this area. But this is going to be a beautiful home. It's going to be a three bedroom, no, sorry, three car garage, four bedroom house. And believe it or not, this house is just five weeks away from being completed, despite what it looks like right now. Once they get to this stage, things do start going a little faster, unfortunately, with our lack of trades and high demand this house is a couple of months behind schedule but things are starting to roll now but uh every builder across the board has been having difficulty getting trades to come out and uh make stuff happen and was this a beautiful home this front room i love the size of this this is a big kind of like the long-term guest bedroom house it's got the nice windows and why I say it's a long-term guest bedroom is it's got a full bath attached to it. So your long-term guests can stay in here and be kind of separated from the rest of the house. Very nice. Nice tall ceilings in this house. This is gonna be your Fletch room. These are actually French doors here. They've kind of got some covering on it to keep the overspray down. But you can do anything you want with this room, turning it to an office, a little mini media room. But flex rooms are extremely popular right now. Let's go check out the garage since we are here. Got a neat little mud room space, place to put your boots and backpacks. But there is no power in here, so I'm sorry if the lighting is a little bad. But they do have tankless water heater, and they do have light up here. Hmm, interesting. But you see up into the attic a little bit. Maybe they got power, but no light switches or lights in most of the house just yet. Anyways, I like doing these new construction follow-up videos for my clients because the house will never look like this again. And it's good to show their friends and family what's going on with their house as of today. Now, there is some water that was leaking here uh, coming out of the laundry room. I looked, I didn't see anything active. I've already contacted the sales reps who sent the pictures. I took them to the construction manager just to confirm that there's nothing wrong. I want them to take a look at this. Because yeah, water's not uh, a good thing to see in a house. But they're, work, they're, gonna, they're coming out right now. You do have your full bath, a dual vanity, and it's kind of hard, hard to see, but you do have a tub shower combo back there. And here's gonna be the uh, secondary bedrooms. Nice closets. Once again, still tall ceilings. And each of these rooms are gonna be a little bit longer than they are wide, but perfect size rooms if you got any little kiddos. And this room kind of mirrors that one. So I don't wanna to waste too much time in here. All right, there's more of that water there. I'm like, hmm, I'll get that looked at. But tall hallway arches. Maybe I should have shut that door. Let me go do that right now. Well, it's a little quieter. But man, check out this kitchen. This kitchen is gonna be big. 
love the two-tone, the darker gray cabinets on the bottom, the light ones up top, they've got a beautiful backsplash. You see they're gonna have the oven and the built-in microwave right there. And big, this is a big island they've got here. Loving it. I've sold quite a few David Weekly homes this year. Actually, I've sold quite a few homes, period. It's been a busy year. But one of the things I do like about David Weekly, and if you've been watching my videos, they really do what they say they're gonna do and they stand behind their product. Um, at their final new construction walkthrough before you close on the house, they really go over this place, the fine tooth comb, making sure buyers are very happy with the house. Your pantry and inspections. It's always good to have a third party inspector come through. Uh, so far, every David Weekly home I've done, they found very, very little things wrong with the house. You're never gonna be completely perfect. These are neat. Let's see if they come out. Nope, they don't. All right, cooktop still gonna come in. We have a nice built-in refrigerator spot. This is what your uh, wood looking tile is looking like. Very nice. This is gonna be kind of your breakfast nook, dining room area, but just look how much living space you've got here. This is nice. Very happy for you guys. All right, let's go, let's go wander outside. Um, one of the things I'm not a big fan about the community is not the biggest backyards, but if that's not what your driving factor is, then hey, you do have a big outdoor entertainment area. I see they got some more repair work to do there, but this is a big, look at that, big outdoor patio space. You can tell they opted to upgrade for an outdoor kitchen setup because this time of year, as I'm filming this, it is early January, 2022. And the weather is absolutely gorgeous here. About 70 degrees, no humidity, sun is shining, beautiful. Well, you can see there's gonna be a little bit of a step down. I'm sure they're gonna be filling this in somewhat. but you can get a pretty good feel for the size of the backyard just by looking at your neighbors. So you can see this is where that fence line is going to be coming through and you kind of marry it up to where the back is going to be. Nice stucco on the back part with the grays and the whites. All right, let's head into the owner suite. I said, love the wide hallway coming in. All right, this is the owner suite back here. Lots of windows. Once again, tall ceilings. It can be a little dark in here because like I said, no lights, but check out this, what they call the super shower, which I really like. A big shower is really nice, but they opted for the rain head uh, up above and you've got the other shower head over there. So very nice. Gonna have dual vanities and Water closet tucked away there. And then let's see, i pull up my phone and get a little more light in here. Uh, okay, so I do a combo. So you're gonna have all your wiring come central location there. And you have really nice size closet with a big shoe rack. Ooh, checking out the tiles they selected for the bathroom. 
very, very elegant. Now this is the Rhymer plan. This is one of the more popular plans that David Weekly builds. And you can see why. Oh, I see they also got this pre-wired for a sound system up top. Ooh, they got the for Atmos capability. So you can have your Atmos speakers in the middle and then your rear speakers over there. I have to come over here and watch a movie with these guys once they get it fully going. So it can be a beautiful house. I'm excited that things are gonna start going a lot faster now that they got the cabinets up and the countertops in. The rest of the stuff's gonna go pretty quick. All right, that's gonna wrap up this home being built by David Weekly in the Veramini community in New Braunfels. This is the Rhymer plan. And if you got any questions or thinking about moving to the beautiful Texas Hill Country town in New Braunfels, give me a call. And I also sell pretty much everywhere in this area. So I'm a realtor trying to grow my business. And yes, these videos are helping. All right, that's gonna do it for today. Talk to you soon. Take care now. Oh yeah, like and subscribe. All right, bye.